Hey guys, welcome back to SolidWorks Science Tutor YouTube channel. Before starting the video, if you are new and haven't subscribed our channel, please press the subscribe button so that you can get the notification for our latest videos. So in this SolidWorks exercise number 15, we are going to make this part. So as you can see that this is the complex part and we see how we can make the twist between these uh, two components and how we can make this part. So let's start. So first of all, we are going to make the sketch, select the front plane, go to sketch and make the rectangle, select the center rectangle from here and make a rectangle like this, select the dimension and give the vertical dimension of 100 mm and horizontal dimension of 80 mm like this. So now we are going to make the arc like this. So now from here you can see the radius of the arc is 40 mm. Now simply select the trim entities and trim this intersecting entity from here and select the circle. So we are going to make the circle at the center of this larger circle. Now simply go to dimension and give it the die of 30 m like this. So our first sketch is ready. Now from here you can see that it is fully defined sketch. Now we will go to extrude boss base command and simply select 10 mm uh, blind depth from here select ok. So now what we are going to do is we are going to shift the plane from this surface or you can see say that we can we are going to offset the plane from this surface with the distance of 30 mm select ok. Now again uh, sketch on this plane simply select this face select convert entities now again select this edge and select convert entities. So now you can see that how quickly our uh, same sketch is ready again give the depth of 10 mm select ok. So now you can see our half part is ready. Now we are going to make another sketch on this right plane. Simply go to sketch again, select normal to from here and make the center lines or you can also say the reference line for our new sketch. Now simply make the line from the center and give it the length of 200 mm like this. So now again select the corner rectangle. So now this time we are again going to give it the dimension of 100 mm and with the width of 80 mm. So to make this uh, sketch center we will simply select the midpoint of this line and we will select the center line and we will uh, make them coincident or vertical. So now we will select the midpoint of this sketch and we will select this point and we will make them coincident like this. So now you can see that our half sketch is ready. Select the three point arc again and again make the arc of radius 40 mm like this. Now again simply trim the entities and repeat the procedure for the 30 mm dia circle like this. Now simply select ok from here and give it the depth of 10 mm with the offset of 10 mm like this. So select ok from here again. Now what we are going to do is we are going to mirror this uh, body. So simply go to the mirror command, select the right plane from here and from here you have to select the bodies. So this is the body we are going to mirror. So now simply select ok from here and you can see our part is ready. So now what we are going to do is we are going to make the twisting between these two parts. So first of all, uh, we are going to uh, use the lofted boss base command. 
so i have uh, explained the lofted bus base command with guide curves uh, with the detail in the videos so i will provide the link in the description you can watch the uh, detail video from there so now we will select this face and for loft we are going to select this face so now you can see that the twisting has made due to this directional point so if i will change this point you can see that the shape has been changed so we are going to make it twist so we are going to select this edge so select okay from here and again repeat the procedure for another part so which is this one select this face and this face and now select this edge like this so now you can see that how easily we have made the twisting between this part if you want to make the simple loft you have to adjust these edges like this you can see so we are going to make twisting so we are to select these two edges so select okay from here and now you can see how easily we have made this part so this was a simple exercise on solidworks thank you for watching keep supporting and keep sharing our channel for the more interesting videos